because it's already written that I'm to be successful. I'm already successful. I've already won. All right. <laughs> so stick around and let's level up together. Let's talk strategy. Let's talk commitment. Let's talk psychology. Those are the ingredients of a successful trader. You must be patient. You must have discipline in your approach. Yeah. You feel that. You feel that. You feel that, that fire within you. That drive to be successful. How bad do you want it? I want it bad. Because I need this for my children. I need this for my wife. I need this for my family. I need this for the people to come behind me. I need them to know that I gave it everything I got. Yeah, got a new track, I'm feeling good. I'm staying motivated, I'm staying focused. Yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. Trade the motivation. Keep yourself motivated. Know that you have everything that you need to be successful when it comes to the trading. You are highly intelligent. You are highly resourceful. You've come through so much. Yes, sir. We get it in over here. I won't let anybody stop me from my mission. When I leave this earth, I want my creator to say, yeah, he was flawed. He dropped the ball so many times, but he kept getting up. He kept trying. He kept striving. He kept working on trying to get better. Okay, as human beings, we are flawed. You have to be honest with yourself, you are flawed. But you know your flaws, you know what you need to work on. Nobody knows yourself like you. Stop avoiding the work. It, it requires work. You have to put in the work to overcome those things that are holding you back. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yes, sir. Look at this beautiful view. Mm. The bounties given to us by the Creator. We thank you. We thank you. Yes, sir. We're going to a whole nother level. They're not even ready. They're not even ready. <laughs> I pray that you bless me with the ability to keep this current state of focus. I'm feeling real peaceful. I've dealt with anxiety, with stress all my life. I got this breeze blowing on my back at this moment. None of it matters because I know that I've already won. I'm successful. I need a new beat. Keep it coming. I need a new beat. Might have something here. The bridge. No, that's not enough flavor. Okay, I feel this one. I feel this one. Okay, let's go. Yeah. All right, if you're struggling with trading, first you need to identify, do I actually have a setup that has the potential of producing an edge? Not all setups are created equal. You might be working with something that doesn't even have a chance. You might be wasting your time. Don't be afraid to reach out. I can point you in the right direction if you're struggling. Let's link up. I need to pay attention before I fall and break my neck. Are you tired of blowing accounts? Ask yourself, are you ready to put in the work? Are you ready to overcome that fear that you feel in your stomach when you're going to draw down? Can't be afraid. You have to release that fear. You have to set it down and walk away from it. Look back at it. That's what they say, look back at it. Look back at that fear. I'm leaving you behind. No time. No time on to bigger and better. We leave that fear behind us. We're going straight ahead. We're going straight ahead. The bigger and better things. That's how trading works. Once you realize that the spoils of war come to those that put in the prep work, <laughs> you actually start partaking in the success and it feels amazing. It feels amazing. Look at all these steps. I need to watch what I'm doing. 
Before I fall down these steps, tumble, tumble like Humpty Dumpty. I'm getting further and further away. I'm getting further and further away. What's up, what's up? <laughs> it's my man right there. Professional, professional photographer. I see you. I got the helicopter, I'm late. I'm late, here I come. Hold up, it's my personal chopper. No, not yet. One day, one, one day, one day we're gonna get the professional chopper. All right, I'm gonna slow it down, get the low key vibe going. Of course, we talk about training, but I just want to take a moment to just enjoy life. Enjoy this moment of clarity where everything is making sense. When I take the time to realize how blessed I really am. You know, I have to be honest with myself. A lot of times I get caught up in the current trial, the current struggle that I'm going through. I lose sight of, my God, I'm so, so blessed, you know? We, we make a special prayer for the people that are suffering in the world, don't have enough to eat. People losing their lives, losing love, loved ones, 100% innocent. We send up a special prayer for those people. We acknowledge the fact that the things I'm dealing with are so trivial in comparison. My bills are paid. I have food in the refrigerator. I have an ice cold kombucha waiting for me when I get home. My family is healthy. All is well in the universe. Be grateful for what you have. That's an important part of being a successful trader, is being grateful. Okay, stop, stop going for the home run with your trades. When your profit target is reached, take it and run. Get out. Be grateful for that win. Stop looking at these other videos where people are boasting about a certain dollar amount. It makes you feel like your, your win is insignificant or it doesn't matter or it doesn't measure up. If it's part of your plan and if it was successful, you are a winner. I want every trade that you take to be in one of two categories. A winning trade that matches your rules and a losing trade that matches your rules. We don't want any trades that don't belong to us. Trades that don't belong to us are anything that's outside of our rules. Our trading rules give us the authority to move forward with the trade. Okay, it needs to be painful when we step outside of our rules. If you look on Reddit, if you look in the comments of any YouTube video that talks about success and profit and trading, you'll see a common theme. I deviated from my rules and I got my back broken. I strayed from my rules and I blown my account. I can't stay consistent. As soon as I win, I give it all back. That's the common refrain. Why is that? It's because people are not willing to comply with the rules. The rules require discipline. The, re the rules require consistency. The rules require gratefulness. You must be grateful if you want a shot at joining the ranks of those that are profitable. That's what we're about on this channel. Feeling good, so good. Basking in the beauty. Look at those steps. I need to, I need to run up those steps. I need to run up those steps. I'm looking at the arch. Nice majestic structure. It's been a while since I've gone up in that thing. It's got the elevator where it's constantly adjusting and going back and forth. Don't eat anything rich before you do that. You might throw up in the elevator. <laughs> of course, they have funnel cakes right, <laughs> right at the base. Get your funnel cake and go up on the arch elevator and throw up on the other passengers. That's cool. Get your funnel cake. Fresh cut fries, soda. Bottle water, ice cream, funnel cake, and arch elevator. Horrible combination. <laughs> we have the riverboat cruise over here. Yes, sir. Getting it in today. 
feeling good, feeling marvelous, basking in the glory. It's all good. The universe has spoken. It has spoken and I am listening. I am listening. I am seeing with my eyes the signs, the similarities in life that all apply to trading. Those that are successful, those that can work in here, work on the inside. Uh huh. I'm an impatient person. That's what's held me back. I can point to all the things that have come up in my life that have been so difficult. They have some form of impatience tied to them. That is my internal struggle. And it also equates to my internal struggle with trading. Okay, when I started trading, I was blowing account after account because I was impatient. I needed money. I needed money yesterday. So all the structure that was necessary, I wasn't complying. I was hard headed. I said, you know what? I'm going to rely on my, my unwavering work ethic and my resourcefulness to make me profitable. That wasn't enough. That wasn't enough. It wasn't until I coded my strategy and saw the numbers, saw the data in front of me, got the train pulling up, got the Amtrak train pulling up. When I did that, that changed everything literally overnight. I saw it in front of my eyes. The data, me and the data had an intimate conversation. We sat down, had a heart to heart. I said, okay, data, talk to me. Show me what I've been missing. The data said, listen, 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 my guy. That's what the data said. The data was like, look, I can give you the blueprint, but you have to follow it. All right, I'm, I'm here. I'm here in front of your face. But if you don't wipe the blinders or remove the blinders, it'll go right past you. I said, okay, that's interesting. Dada, tell me more. Dada said, listen, why do you think it is that the corporations are tracking everything that you do? I said, facts, facts, Dada, okay. Okay, tell me more. Dada was like, listen, they track everything that you do and then they use that information to prepare customized products, customized feeds that tie into your personal mindset. Printing money, that's what they do. What'd you say? Uh, I believe so, yeah, it wraps around. Okay, y'all have a great day. I need a new beat. Give me something. Come on, I'm talking about my conversation with Data. We have a new vibe. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, the Data was like, I, I can show you the way, but if you're unwilling to follow, then it's just another wasted opportunity. I said, okay, Data. I'm loving what I'm hearing. This message that you're telling me is resonating with my spirit. Because what I've been trying, it hasn't been working. So I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to comply. It's my first step. The data was like, look, the key is to not be too greedy. All right, everybody's chasing the big win. Everybody's looking for what's sexy. The big win is sexy. The data told me and said, the key is to be content with the bass hits. The key is to be content with waiting for your setup. The key is to be content with not trading every day. Sometimes your setup doesn't present itself, so you just sit back, you sit on your hands. I said, mm-hmm, you know what, you have a point. Up until this point, I felt I had a place to trade every day or it would be a wasted day. <laughs> if there was no setup present, I would force a setup. I would make a setup just so that I could take a trade. So I felt that 
any trade is better than no trade. That's what I felt. That's what, it, that's what will lead you to ruin. All right, so <laughs> you know you know you have it within you. You know that you have the heart of a lion. You feel it. Your DNA has success embedded in it. You have to learn to harness it. And that's how you become successful. You harness that. You harness that success that is embedded in your DNA. How you ladies doing? All right. All right. Unlock that potential. Bask in the mercy. Bask in the blessings that await for you. All right. As usual, trust the process. Be patient and don't over leverage and you will be successful. All right. <laughs>